United has always been at the forefront of things. When we are hit with an obstacle, we actually try to effect change. When the virus first took hold, basically we did not go into the nursing home. So for, for four months, I wasn't there at all, which was very difficult. We're used to being very hands-on, and now I'm trying to manage from home. When they had to be removed from those facilities, it created a gap. The care that they provide supports not only the, the, the members and their families, but the facilities as well. as well. It takes a lot of pressure off the facilities, having a, another clinician at that level to be able to be in and, and provide that care. And United Healthcare came up with a great and interesting um, idea, and that's using technologies to communicate and maintain relationships with our patients. So we offered iPads to the different nursing homes. Hey! Lanessa have remained COVID negative. They have not had a positive case in that building. So I think that speaks a lot to the care that they have for their, mem for their residents um, and their attention to detail. They understood that with the COVID pandemic, there was um, a, a break in the continuity of our care. And they recognized right away that technology, the use of the iPad, was a great way to mitigate that potential gap in care. It's a video. I've seen it. Oh. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing? Being able to use telehealth has helped them feel connected. Rather than a phone call, they can still see them. and. Um, you know, that visual connection is just important to them. And, and tell me, what kind of foods are you eating? And they literally can do physical examinations with the iPad. We can look at skin issues, range of motion issues, breathing issues. Really, it's almost exactly as if the clinician were there. It's, it's like amazing what can be done. I mean, nice and easy. I never expected it to be like that. And we have to communicate, ensuring everybody knows what we're doing and how we're doing it. Not just here at the local plan, but with our leadership at United Healthcare. And we can communicate with our partners and peers in other states as well. This is what we're doing here. This is the best practice. So we're working together to make sure that the whole system works well. It was an eye opener for me to realize that I could provide high quality care from afar. The nursing home is their home. Okay, we want to keep them there, yet provide the best possible care. My primary goal is to treat them where they are, treat them early, and avoid that hospitalization at all costs if we can. And it ties right into our mission as well. Integrity, compassion, innovation, performance, and relationships. Really ties in so that we can serve our mission, fulfill our mission of helping people live healthier lives. There's so much social isolation going on now within uh, the nursing home in many settings. And the iPad has been wonderful as far as that's concerned. They can visit with loved ones. They can hear their voices. They can see them. Bye-bye. Bye-bye <laughs> now. I love you. Thank you for calling. A resident's feeling down, you know, they're expressing they're missing their loved one. Um, utilizing that iPad um, has helped them, you know, lift their spirits up. But the youngest granddaughter's got twins, so I can see them. To be able to actually lay eyes on your loved one and to see that, yes, they are okay, I think that was very comforting. Take care. Okay. <laughs> Nursing care has always had the patient at the center. That has never changed. We've just had to find different ways of keeping the patient at the center of our care. And the patients are very appreciative and responsive. And so it's not just about the clinical and the medical care, but it's about having that quality of life. And it really is connecting the emotional and the spiritual right along with the physical health. Mm -hmm.